today on and meet the University of Iowa doctor who unlocked the anti-aging properties of a certain vitamin. We're going to explain this, what NR is about, what that, that cellular model is about too, and 100. So up next, a breakthrough in anti-aging through a new form of vitamin D3. You're thinking, what? Well, a PhD at the University of Iowa made the discovery. And Dr. Charles Brenner joins us here next on Paula Sands Live. Thank you, Katie. Well, the big buzz in the science world right now is about a form of vitamin B3 that protects cells from aging. It all started with a discovery from a University of Iowa expert who joins me now, Dr. Charles Brenner, leading authority on this nutrient that we're about to talk about. I'm so glad you're here to talk about this, Thanks, Doctor. Paula. My I, pleasure. I don't think this is the kind of thing that we would, we would normally speak of because this is pretty new isn't it to, to the new. public it's pretty new i was minding my own business back in 2004 at dartmouth i was working on the synthesis of nad which is the central me regulator of metabolism and we found essentially a new vitamin another way to boost nad well you have a lovely um, remember science class everybody uh, a little model of a cell yeah, here about how cell. as we yeah. age our cells just they expire Right. right. Well, or... one, one of the key things is that NAD, which is the central regulator of metabolism, is required for many, many functions. So in, in the nucleus here, it protects DNA from damage. It helps with gene expression and sort of maintaining youthful gene expression. And out here in the cytoplasm and in the mitochondria, it's involved in converting food into energy, cellular ATP, as well as promoting resiliency due to helping us resist reactive oxygen stress. NAD is required for all of those things, and NAD declines in aging. Mm -hmm. And that's why we're seeing that boosting NAD with nicotinamide riboside, NR, NR. is actually very helpful. NR. So yep. you brought this just so we have, yep. have an yep. idea what this yep. is. So this NR, is this a... How do we get it? Is it a supplement? Is it found in food? Yep, yep. all of the above. So it's a vitamin. Uh, we initially found it in milk. You might ask me, how much milk do I drink? I'm actually lactose intolerant. I don't drink any milk. You really? Yeah. Um, in, a, in a supplement form, you can get sort of a day's worth of uh, food-derived NR in a, in a pill, and people are finding that it helps them sort of maintain re youthful resiliency. Yes, because the benefits of having these higher levels are all kinds of things we all want more of. The mental clarity, the higher, the metabolism boost, uh, there was another thing, uh, the energy. Right. So is, is this a, would you call this a cure-all? Is this really some kind of a turning point? Well, cure-all, I mean, it's not right now intended to treat any disease or condition. So it's used by healthy adults, although we are testing it in uh, animal systems and we basically find that animals that are under metabolic stress, like type 2 diabetes or chemotherapy treatment, hmm. actually get greater benefits from nicotinamide riboside than healthy active animals. Okay, so, so uh, again, uh, the simple way of explaining NR is that it is a unique form of vitamin D, B3, sorry, B3, B3. B3. Yep. and if you look, well, there's a, a website you uh, are directing us to, yes. about NR. About NR.com, so we're not selling here, anything here, we just, we want people to get real evidence-based information about NR, so and I, about NR.com. And I appreciate that, that, so we're not selling a supplement here at all, but I know people at home are saying, well, I, I would like to take something so I could boost my NAD. Yeah, you know, so yeah. get this NR in. Am I going to find it at a health food store? Yeah, you'll find it on the internet, and okay. yeah, yeah, no question about it. It's on the market. Yes, nicotinamide riboside is is manufactured safely, GMP production, mm -hmm. and it's been clinically tested. It boosts NAD in human beings. It's orally available, and it's generally regarded as safe by the Food and Drug Administration. Do you take it? Yes, I do. And and you're uh, 95 years old. <laughs> I'm actually 55. It's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> no, really, I would say it's worked well. Yeah, so the, the, the research continues on this. Yes, absolutely. So we're doing things in animals, we're testing it in people, and we expect that the uh, story is really just beginning about the benefits of NR. And I, going on in Iowa City right now. Yes, it is. Dr. Brenner, I'm so glad you were here today. Thanks, my All pleasure. the best to you. All Thank right. you so much. Great.